George, a really tough game here in Montpellier. How are you feeling after that one? Yeah, it was special for me. I think that's my first start in the Champions Cup. Um, so I enjoyed it. But result-wise, we all feel like we could have given more, could have done better. But at the end of the day, it's 14 points between us and we take it back to the stoop next week. So. There's positives to take from the game. A massive Montpellier pack, but we fronted up really well in that aspect of the game, didn't we? Yeah, no, we did. I think especially in the second half, the key points at half-time where there's no excuses. Everyone's got to step up individually. So I think it was just a fact of boys manning up and you know, taking on the role themselves. When the game breaks up a little bit like that, it seems to suit you. Did you enjoy yourself out there? Yeah, no, I enjoyed it. Um, obviously, the try, I saw Marcus, we kind of caught eyes. They flew up and then I kind of knew he was going to kick it behind. Um, but no, exactly like it suits Lewis. Interception, he's making breaks left, right and centre. So, yeah, it suits us as a team. You've been back inside the changing room now. What was said at full time? Who were the voices and what's being said? Um, it was all quite positive. I think we're very confident we can take it back to the stoop and do a job. So it's all about coming out the blocks next week. We, we said it was quite embarrassing, that first half result. So we just need to work on that for next week. Just make sure we get it right. And the away fans were so noisy here today. Yeah. Uh, just a word on them. Oh, it was unreal. We had like two blocks over there. It was just constant noise. Yeah, it was class. And they're going to they're gonna have a massive role next week at home, aren't they, if we want to turn this one around? Yeah, 100%. I mean, they always get behind us. You can hear it on the pitch. We'll feel it. So, yeah, it's exciting. Take it back.